Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Ramandiosia. He called that Baba Tiri and did Oh, Shabamandios. Conda the Babadiri and the Bek Conda Rabba Bandiosia Conda Rabandiosia Rota Rabba Conda the Bebe Shona Conda the Babadiri and the Lebe Conda the Bobosia Shona Rabba Diri and the Lebe Conda the Babandiri Sila Conda the Babadiri on the Bobosia Conda the Babadiri and the Lebe Conda the Bobosia Conda da babadiri and the lebe conda da baba. Randa da badora babadiri and the lebe conaya. He shola babadiri on the bobosia. Hallelujah, God. He conda da baba. Randa da badora babadiri and the lebe show. Who she command the osia. He conda the babadiri on the bobosia. Hallelujah, God. He call your babe. He call your babe shia. Hallelujah. Your God, Hallelujah, Jesus, Hallelujah, God. He command the, He command the ocean. Randa de betonda, He come the be the under the boom. Hallelujah, God, Hallelujah, Lord. He come on the ocean. God, we give you all the glory this morning. We give you all the praise. We give you all. He command us for Lord, you are good, Lord, you are great, Lord, you are mighty, Lord, you are excellent in all your ways. He command us, and we, your people, we acknowledge you this morning. You are our God, we acknowledge your presence. You are our Father, you are our God, you are our everything. He can be and we come come to give you great praise on this morning. Uh, we come to honor you on this morning. Uh, we come to lift you up and magnify you. Uh, we come to esteem your name on high. Uh, to you be glory. Uh, to you be dominion. Uh, to you be power. To you be honor. He uh, We bow down, oh God, uh, and we worship you, oh Lord. Uh, in spirit and in truth. We give your name great praise on this morning. And we say thank you. Thank you for being God. Thank you for being our God. Thank you for being our Father. Thank you for being our everything. Thank you for being the answer, Jesus. Thank you for being the door. Thank you for being the way. Thank you for being the resurrection. Thank you for being life. Thank you for being life. Thank you. Oh, say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We come for no other reason than to give your name great praise and to honor you and to adore you and to thank you for being who you are on this morning. We lift our hands, we lift our hands where we are and we worship you. We say thank you, thank you for everything. Thank you for keeping us. Thank you for bringing us this far. We've come this far by faith. This far by faith. This far by faith. He can live We walk by faith. We live by faith. Without faith, it's impossible to please you. He can live And we want to please you. We want to please you because we love you. You said if we love you, keep your commandments. If we love you, feed your sheep. If we love you, feed your lamb. He come on those And we, your people, love you. We love you because you first loved us. We love you because you look beyond our faults.
fault and you see our need. We love you because you love us in spite of us. We love you because you sent your only begotten son Jesus to die on the cross for us. For us. For the remission of our sin. For us. You did that for us. And so we love you right back. I thank you for your presence even now. He come and die. The presence of the Lord is here. He come He come We love you, God. He come He come and And we thank you, God. He come and die. We love you and we thank you. We love you. We thank you. We bless you. We love you. We thank you. We bless you. We worship you. He come and for you seeking for such to worship you in spirit and in truth and we worship you oh God in spirit and in truth in spirit and in truth we worship you in spirit and in truth he come on they say we worship you in spirit and in truth in spirit and in truth. While others are frantic, while others are worrying, while others are stressing about today, we choose to worship you. We choose to bless you. We choose to magnify you. We choose to lift you up. We choose to glorify you. We purpose in our hearts to do so. While others, God, are in a state of panic. He come on day, shall it be so? While others are so concerned about today. We purpose in our hearts. We choose to bless you. We choose to bless you. We choose to worship you. We choose to magnify you. We choose to give your name great praise. We make a conscious decision. Yay! To bless your name. To bless the wonderful name of Jesus. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. And the righteous run in. And are safe. Ooh, shy. And are safe. We give you glory that we're saved. And we're safe. And we're covered, and we're protected, and we're shielded. Yes, We give you praise for that, God. You take great care of us. You take great care of us. You're an excellent father, and you're excellent in all your ways. You're an excellent father. You're an excellent father, and you're excellent in all your ways. Yes, Shata. In the name of Jesus, 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 we pray. We come this morning to bind fear. We come this morning to cancel out fear. Out of the minds, out of the thoughts of the people of God. He come on, do the rebeco. We have no need to fear. Come on here. Say it out your mouth this morning. I have no need to fear. God didn't give me the spirit of fear. That doesn't come from my God. Fear doesn't come from my God. He come on, do the rebeco. The Bible says, God says, I didn't give you the spirit of fear. What I gave you was power and love and the sound mind. That's what I gave you. God didn't give us the spirit of fear. We shall not fear. We shall not be afraid. We guard our ear gates. We guard our ear gates from the spirit of fear. The spirit of panic, how shall it go? Anxiety, he can deliver shelter, he can deliver cold stress about today. He 
Fear is speaking and fear is speaking loud. But the Spirit of God, He shall be called the love of God. Perfect love, it cancels out all fear. He commands us to be called. Perfect love is God, and God is canceling out all fear. He commands condo out of your mind, out of your thoughts. He live in He shall my condo Keep your mind stayed on Jesus, and He'll keep you in perfect peace. Somebody say, I'm keeping my mind stayed on Jesus. I'm keeping my mind stayed on Jesus. I'm keeping my mind stayed on Jesus. I'm keeping my mind. I'm keeping my thoughts. I'm keeping my heart. I'm keeping my eyes stayed on Jesus. He come on to the rebel kotai, and he's gonna keep you in perfect peace. He live in Kulebe Kondo. He said so. Somebody say he said so. That's what he said. He said so. He live in Rebe Kotai. He said so. He get the call. He said, think on me. He should live so tight. Keep your mind on me. Oh, shake He shake He said, keep your mind stayed on me, and I'll keep you. Keep your mind stayed on me, and I'll keep you. I'll keep you in perfect peace. Thus saith the Lord. He live in Kondo Rebe. He come on Dole Rebe Keep your mind stayed on Jesus. Don't let your mind wander. Don't let your thoughts wander. Don't let your thoughts get the best of you. He live in Kondo Rebe. Guard your ear gate. Guard your eye gate. Stop looking at everything. Stop listening to everything. He live in Lune Rebe. He said it so. Some of the people that are on social media, they don't know God. They don't know His word. He lived in Kondo Shatai. God told us to be not troubled. He said, I told you that this was going to happen. I told you there's going to be wars and rumors of wars. I told you there's going to be earthquakes. I told you there's going to be famines and pestilences. I told you already. He come up Kondo Shatai. And I also told you. You see that you be not troubled. Woo, see that you be not troubled. Assure your children. Come to your children. Come to your house. Comfort your spouse. Worship God. Worship God with a pure heart. Worship God in the beauty of holiness. Worship God in spirit and in truth. He come and do the and let me tell you something now. God knows. He knows who's his. He He hears and he sees. While others are plotting and planning. Plotting and planning on destruction. Plotting and planning on deception. He come on day with the spirit of murder. He come on do the looking to see what they can tear up. He come to the so he said, I got a remnant that's worshiping me, that's encouraging the believers. He can live condo that's praising me, that's seeking me, that's bowing down to me. He come to the condo He said, I know those who are mine. He come on do the run the so and when it looks like in the spirit. Family. It looks like a light, a bright light beaming. He shall be cold in your house. Oh, I see it in the spirit. It looks like a bright light beaming in your church, beaming in your house. He live in condo You're covered. He cut who tell him you're covered from any plague, you're covered from any pestilence, you're covered from any disease, you're covered from famine. I get a shot. God gonna see to it that his people, that his children, 
are well taken care of. He come to the Rebecca, just like the children of Israel when they were in Goshen. He lived in the Rebecca. They were able to see. They were able to see in Egypt. He can live all the plagues. They were able to see it. They heard him crying out. Who shut the Rebecca? He lived in when our wall it was pitch black. Wall was pitch black in Egypt. The Bible says that the children of Israel had light in their dwellings. They had light in their homes. Come on here. Thank you, Holy Ghost. And that's how it is. That's how it is. I'm telling you. I see it so clear. He come and do the Rebecca. He come and look We God's people. We shall have light in our dwellings. He come to live And that's the presence of God. That's the glory of God. That's the spirit of God. You have no need to be afraid. You have no need to worry. He come and do the Rebecca. So open up your doors. Open up your windows. And kick fear up out of there. He live in Get fear out of your mind. Get fear out of your heart. Get fear out of your eyes. Get fear out of your ears. Get fear out of your mouth. Get it out of there. He can live in Kick it out. Who shall live in Fear, you got to go. He come on, do shall go. Panic, you got to go. He come on, do Anxiety, you got to go. Stress, you got to go. Worry, you got to go now. In the name of Jesus. Ooh, in the name of Jesus, he come and die. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name. Randa de be didi be ko, konda da ba du de be didi yende le be ko na. Randa da ba du de be konda le be be. He konda de be didi yende le be sa. He konda do ba bausia. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, he come on that the presence of the Lord is here. Yesha, the presence of the Lord is here. The presence of the Lord is here. He come on the Rebekota on this live stream. He shall be called with us in wherever you are. He shall be called in here with me. The presence of the Lord is with us. He let me call the glory of God, the revealed, manifested presence of God. You're covered. You're covered. Do you hear me? You're covered. You're saved and you're safe, you're protected, you're shielded. He can deliver conda, ain't no hurt, harm, or danger. It's coming nigh you, it's coming nigh your dwelling. He can deliver conda, it ain't coming near your children. He come and do deliver it ain't coming near your spouse. Who shut up, Raka? He shall in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Rakabakotai, Hitaba Rabakotai, Rantabe Rebe Shata. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name, we believe what we pray for when we pray. He come to the Rebe Kotai, Rende Lebe Kotai. We know that we decree a thing. It's established. We decree it. Huh? We agree with God. We agree with heaven. We agree with his word. Read with me. Psalm 91. Psalm 91. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the most high shall abide under the shadow. Ah! Under the shadow of the Almighty, he that stays in prayer, yeah, he that he that has his heart turned towards God, turned towards Jesus, yeah, praying in your heart, uh, your spirit praying, uh, that's your secret place. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide. You shall stay. You shall stay covered. The Bible says under the shadow of the Almighty. You shall stay covered. Yeah. He said it. You shall stay covered. I will say of the Lord. He is my refuge. And my fortress. My God in him will I trust. Surely he shall deliver thee. 
from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover thee with his feathers and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid. Hear God, family. Hear the word. Thou shalt not be afraid. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day, nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness. The pestilence walks in darkness. But we're in the light. We're in the light. We have light. We have God. We have the glory of God. We're glory carriers. The pestilence walketh in darkness. Nor for the destruction that wasted at noonday. Come on. A thousand shall fall at thy side. And ten thousand at thy right hand. But it shall not come nigh thee. But it shall not come nigh thee. Hear God this morning, family. It shall not come nigh thee. It ain't coming near you. It ain't coming near your house. It ain't coming near your children. Yeah! Only with your eyes, only with thine eyes, shalt thou behold and see the reward of the wicked. You hear me? Yeah! Shut up. Only with your eyes, just like the children of Israel in Goshen was able to see, they was able to hear what was happening in Egypt. Yeah, Only with thy eyes shalt thou behold and see the reward of the wicked. God said, because thou hast made the Lord, which is my, our refuge, even the most high, our habitation, our habitation family. He said, there shall no evil befall thee. You hear God? There shall no evil befall thee. There shall no evil befall thee. Neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. Do you hear God? Neither shall any plague, any plague come nigh thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against the stone. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and adder, the young lion and the dragon, shalt thou trample under foot, under feet, because he hath set his love upon me. Therefore will I deliver him. You hear God? Because we have set our love upon him. Therefore will he deliver us. Therefore will he deliver us family. Yes. I will set him on high. Because he has known my name. This is what God is saying to us. Yes. He shall call upon me. And I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble you hear this I will be with him in trouble I will deliver him and honor him with long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation so you got to get it out of your mind get it out of your thoughts yes that all this is about to befall you no it ain't happening to you it ain't happening to us. It ain't befalling on us. Not the people of God. We love God. We worship God in spirit and in truth. We live in according to his word. We're standing on his promises. We agree with heaven. We are obedient to what he's telling us to do. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. Yes, I was praying this morning, family. I was praying this morning and God told me, he told me to get on, hallelujah, and encourage and remind the people of God 
and to bind fear. He said because uh, the enemy has put it in people's thoughts and put it in people's minds. There's so much that is going to happen to them that it's got them panicking. The word of God is still going to go forth. He said, yes, there's going to be wars and rumors of wars, earthquakes and pestilences and famines. He said, but see that you be not troubled. See that you be not afraid. See that you be not weary and scared. Yeah, shall it come to Not you. Not you, not us. See that that don't happen to you. See that you don't let your mind run away from you. All day long, you can't even enjoy your day. You can't even enjoy the day that the Lord has made because you're so afraid and, and panicking and study rehearsing in your mind and your speech and study talking about it. Study talking about the eclipse. Study talking about it's going to get dark. Study talking about this. God said, no, you worship me. You worship me in spirit and in truth. You keep giving me great praise. You keep doing what I created you to do. I created you for my good pleasure. Oh, God is speaking to you this morning. He said, I created you for myself. Yeah. I want you to have life and life more abundantly. In the mighty name of Jesus, I want you to think on my goodness. Yeah. I want you to keep your heart and your mind stayed on me, saith the Lord. Keep your heart, your mind, your eyes stayed on me. Yeah, he said, I'll keep you. I'll keep you. I'll keep you in perfect peace. I'll keep you in perfect peace. Why are you worrying about tomorrow? Tomorrow ain't even here yet. Yeah, Shelikota. Don't let your mind run away with you. Don't let your thoughts run away with you. Don't be somewhere living in the what if. The what if, the what if, the what if. God told us. He's already told you what's going to happen. And I told you to be not troubled. I told you to be not troubled. <laughs> I told you to be not troubled. I watched the story of Moses on, on, um, on Netflix family. And it blessed my soul. It was it's a visual. Hallelujah. It's a visual. It allowed me to see each and every time God sent Moses back to Pharaoh. And Pharaoh's heart was so hard that God said, Okay, now I got to hit you with another plague. Okay, now I got to hit you with another plague. His heart was so hard. But the children of Israel, that wasn't happening to them. It wasn't, they wasn't experiencing the frogs. They wasn't experiencing the flies. Yeah, they wasn't experiencing the locusts. Yeah, Shiliko. They wasn't experiencing the darkness. It was dark for three days in Egypt. But guess what? The children of Israel wasn't experiencing that. The Bible said they had light in their dwelling. Come on, Holy Ghost. God wants you to be encouraged on this morning. This, this day today is the day that the Lord has made. This is the day that the Lord has made. We ain't going to give up our praise. We're not going to give up our praise. God spoke to us yesterday. He said, no matter what. No matter what, don't lose your praise. No matter what, don't lose your praise. We, we, we pray the scripture. I will bless the Lord at all times. And his praise shall continually be in my mouth. We say that. We rehearse that. But when push comes to shove and when something happens in the earth, we stop our praise. When something happens that, that, that troubles us, when something happens that goes on, we stop our praise. Why? God is still God. God is still good. God is still exceptional in all his ways. Wonderful in all his ways. Excellent in all his ways. God is still wonderful. That's why I love, I love it when Job, when everything befell on Job. Job was perfect and upright. I just can't even leave it alone. Because it's, it's stuck in my mind. God is saying, remember this. Job was perfect and upright family. 
He lost everything. He said, naked I came in this world. Naked I'm going to leave. The Bible said he took off his clothes, shaved his head, and bowed down and worshiped God. When all hell broke loose in his life, that's what Job did. Yeah, shall it be caught I keep your praise high, family. Stay lit. Stay on fire for Christ. No matter what. No matter what. Keep your light. Keep your flame. Keep it lit. Keep it high. Keep your praise high. No matter what happens in this earth. Keep your praise high. Keep your worship high. I will. We will bless the Lord at all times. And his praise shall continually. Somebody say continually. Continually. His praise shall continually be in our mouth. Rakaba show namai, rikaba rubu konai, rikaba kondole bebe konai. Sing praises unto Him. Sing praises unto our God. Sing praises unto our Father. Yeah. Walk around your house, even while you're at work, even while you're driving. God, you are good, and your mercy endures forever. I love you with my whole heart. Hallelujah to you, God. Hallelujah to you, Jesus. Hallelujah to you, Lord. Hallelujah to you. He commando. I worship you, oh God, in spirit and in truth. I love you today. Ain't no rocks got to cry out for me. Ain't no rocks crying out for us. As long as we're breathing, we're going to bless the name of the Lord. If we had 10,000 tongues, we couldn't pray enough. We couldn't bless him enough. We couldn't holler enough. He killed him and God is still God. God is still good. God is still wonderful. Still wonderful. Aya Ratanibeso. Still wonderful. Still wonderful. Who shut up? Ramde de Bekonai. I come to encourage you this morning. I come to remind you this morning. Anybody you come in contact with, anybody you come in contact with on today, minister to them, encourage them, and tell them, who see that you be not troubled. See that you be not troubled. Are you saved? Are you a child of the Most High God? It will behoove you. He should have been called to give your life to him today. Yeah. It will behoove you to yield and surrender all unto him. It will behoove you to turn your back on sin and come out of darkness into his marvelous, marvelous light. It will behoove you. I encourage you to do so. Because God takes great care of his. He said he that dwelleth. He that dwelleth. He that stays. He that lives. In the secret place. You got him in your heart. You got him on your mind. You got him in your thoughts. You thinking about him. You talking to him. You worshiping him. Yeah, on the inside. The Bible says he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide. You shall stay. You shall stay under the shadow of the Almighty. You shall stay covered. You shall stay covered. You shall stay safe. Yeah, you shall stay protected. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Verse 9, he says, because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high thy habitation. He said, there shall no evil, no evil, no evil befall thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. <laughs> neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee. To keep thee in all thy ways. Family, I, I tell people all the time. And some people might think I'm crazy. They might think I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. But it's angels in my house. It's angels outside. Come on, somebody. My grandbaby told my daughter, Mommy, it's giants in here. <laughs> it's giants in here. I know 
know. I, I can't even I can't even tell people to make them believe me. I just know. I just know. We worship God too hard in here. We pray too hard in here for God not to be in here. For his presence not to be in here. And all around the house. I pray and prophesy right now that a firewall of protection is around your dwelling, around your children, around your spouse, around you. A firewall. A firewall. A firewall. God asana God takes great care of his. He takes great care of his. Yes. Just like a good father takes good care of his children. Just like a good mother takes good care of her children. Making sure they eat, making sure they covered, making sure they got what they need. Come on here. You know our God taking great care of us and protecting us. He know where we are. He know He know that we're here. He know what He said in His Word. That's His Word. That's what He said. This is what's gonna happen. This is what's gonna happen. And every word that I spoke over your life, that's gonna happen too. But don't think that what God spoke over your life ain't gonna happen because of what's taking place in the earth. The children of Israel had light in their dwellings. While it was pitch black in Egypt for three days. Darkness that could be felt. So no matter what happens in the earth, you just need to know that you're straight. You just need to know that you're covered. You just need to know that you're protected. Yes, shut up. You just need to know that your church is covered. Your people are covered. Everything pertaining to you is covered. He that dwell, he that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall stay under the shadow of the Almighty. Yeah. This Psalm 91 I encourage you. Throughout the day, if you feel like you're starting to trip, if you feel like you're starting to panic, because you done messed around and heard something. Because your faith is too low. Get in your word. Read Psalm 91. Read Psalm 91. Guard your ear gates. Guard your ear gate. I had to get off of TikTok. Because on TikTok. They got people that want to be a prophet. Bad. People that got a platform. And people that think that they got so many view, viewers. That, that, that the world is listening to them. They on there saying all kind of stuff. They on there saying all kind of stuff. They got people shook. They got people scared to death. Yeah, I can almost understand the people that don't know God being scared. Because they don't know. But what they what they saying and what they share got the people of God got the people of God scared. <laughs> got the people of God shook. The devil is a lie. I know what the word says. I know what God said. I know we in this world, but we not of this world. I know that we passing through here like pilgrims. <laughs> I know we passing through. This is not our home. This is not your home. People have got so comfortable in the earth. This is not your home. We passing through and God going to bless you while you're here. But you're passing through. The world and this desire is going to pass away. But the man that does the will of God gonna reign forever with him. You got to understand this and know this. God already told us this is going to happen. He told us. He keep taking me right back to Matthew 24. I said, God, the people gonna think I don't know no more scriptures than this. He said, read it again. Tell them again. Shut up. Matthew chapter 24 verse 6 And ye shall hear wars and rumors of wars See that you be not troubled See that you be not troubled For all these things must come to pass But the end is not yet He said for nation shall rise against nation And kingdom against kingdom And there shall be famines And pestilences 
and earthquakes. He told us. People said, oh my God, Pastor Kim, did you hear about the earthquake? I said, yes. <laughs> and there will be more earthquakes because God told us. He said, and see that you be not troubled. There shall be famines and pestilences and earthquakes. And earthquakes with an S. In different places. He said, all these are the beginning of sorrows. All of this is the beginning of sorrows. We're coming to the end, family. Yeah, God, Jesus is soon to come. Only the Father knows when. But the word that was spoken over your life is going to be fulfilled. The assignment that you have in God, it has to be complete. Everybody, everybody in the in the world has to know. They have to know the gospel of the kingdom. Verse 13. But he that shall endure unto the end, the same shall be saved. And this gospel of the kingdom, the gospel of the kingdom has to be preached in all the world first. And then the end gonna come. For a witness unto all nations. And then shall the end come. And then shall the end come. Y'all hear God? Ratabakotai. Randa de bedidi andalaba konda de bebe konda. Ikonda de bebe kanda de besaya. Rikanda de bebe konda de bebe konda de babai. I sit in the seat of the intercessor this morning. He shall be caught out and I pray for you. I pray for your house. I pray for your children. I pray for your family. That you don't give fear. You don't give fear of foothold. You don't give fear no place, no room in your house. Do you hear me? Don't give fear no place, no room. Go throughout your house and bind fear. Open up your windows and your doors and command fear. Fear and panic and anxiety to get out of your house. Get out of your heart, out of your mind, out of your thoughts. Out of the thoughts of your children, out of the thoughts of your spouse, out of the mind of your family. No fear. No fear. No fear in the name of Jesus. No fear. Yeah. No fear. No fear. God didn't give us the spirit of fear. That doesn't come from us. I mean, come from God. God doesn't want us to have fear. He gave us power. He gave us love. He gave us a sound mind. You have power, family. You have love. You have a sound mind. I prophesy it. I speak it. I decree it and declare it now. You have power. You have love. You have a sound mind. Your mind is sound. You have power. Power to walk right. Power to talk right. Power to pray. Power to bind. Power to loose. Power to rebuke. Yes, shut up. Power to believe. Power to decree and declare. Power to stand. You have power. You have love. Love is God. God is love. You have power. You have love. And you have a sound mind. Let this mind be in you. Which was also in Christ Jesus. Somebody say I have the mind of Christ. I have the mind of Christ. I have the mind of Christ. I'm Christ minded. Come on, say it out your mouth. I'm, I'm Christ-minded and I have no fear. 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 
I'm Christ minded and I have no fear. Psalm 91 verse 5. Thou shalt not be afraid. Thou shalt not be afraid. Thou shalt not be afraid. Hear God. Thou shalt not be afraid. For the terror by night. Nor for the arrow that flieth by day. Verse 6. Nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness. Nor for the instruction that wasteth at noonday. A thousand go fall at your side. And ten thousand at your right hand. But it ain't coming near you. It ain't coming near you, family. It's not coming near you. Father, we thank you. We bless you. We hear you, God. We are reminded. We are encouraged. We are strengthened. In Jesus' mighty name. We appreciate this time, Father. We appreciate this time this morning. In the, in the mighty name of Jesus. We appreciate it. We love you, Father. We love you. We honor you. We respect you, God. And we give your name great praise. We adore you. We thank you for your goodness. We thank you for your kindness. We thank you for loving us and keeping us. We thank you for protecting us. We thank you for shielding us. You are our shield and our buckler. You are. You are our everything. You are our everything, oh God. We trust you. We trust your voice. We trust your thoughts. We trust your plans. We trust your word. We trust your leading and your guiding. We trust you. Yeah. We trust you, God. Yeah. Rika. We trust your spirit. He shook it. We trust you. We trust you. You told us to trust in you with all our heart and lean not to our own understanding. We ain't leaning to our own understanding, God. We're not leaning to our own understanding. We trusted in you with all that we are. With all that we are, we're trusting in you. You said you would direct us. You would direct us. You would direct us. Thank you for directing us. Thank you for covering us. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for providing and supplying. Yeah. Thank you for being our very present help. Anna. Oh, Ramai. Thank you, God. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I thank you for your peace, God. Being with we, your people. Peace that surpasses. My God, peace that surpasses. I thank you, Father, for peace that surpasses all understanding. God, peace, it surpasses all understanding. It goes way past. And God, we thank you for it. We thank you for your joy, the joy of the Lord that's unspeakable. Thank you, Father, for the joy of the Lord, the joy of you, O oh God, being with we, your people, in the mighty name of Jesus. And I thank you, God, for your unconditional love. Your love is unconditional. Ain't no conditions on it. Yeah. Your love is unconditional. It's never failing. Never. And for that, we give your name great praise, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. May the grace of God, sweet communion of Holy Spirit, rest, rule, and abide with all of us, hence, now, and forever, in Jesus' mighty name. And the people of God say, Amen. I love you, family. And God loves you more. Hallelujah. Be blessed. Be encouraged. Be strengthened. Be reminded to have a wonderful day today. Bless God today. Turn your worship music on. Turn your, turn your praise music on. And bless God all day. All day. Sing praise.
praise unto him and bless his wonderful name, bless his holy name all day to day. Yes, Shalekota, be a light, be a lighthouse, be a beacon of light. Encourage somebody. Encourage whoever crosses your path, whoever calls your phone. Encourage them, strengthen them, pray for them, remind them, lead them to Christ if they're an unbeliever. Minister to them. God is omniscient. He's looking, he's listening, he's watching. Yes! He knows those who are his. In the mighty name of Jesus. I love you. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm gonna let y'all go. Be blessed and have a blessed rest of the day. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen.